Those events, as always, are steeped in security. But in light of what's going on overseas in Afghanistan, can we expect to see even more security this September 11? Now, we want to stress right now that if there are no credible or direct threats, the NYPD and their federal law enforcement partners are on it 24-7 when it comes to monitoring chatter and keeping our city safe. Now, if we take a step back, it was the September 11th terror attacks that led then-President Bush to declare, quote, the war on terror. The American military entered Afghanistan, the aim to topple the Taliban government and to dismantle al-Qaeda, the terror group that executed the 9-11 attacks. That was the beginning of a 20-year-long war. And today we have seen more violence over there with American service members killed the U.S. while the U.S. tries to evacuate people ahead of President Biden's August 31st. 31st deadline. Mayor de Blasio was asked today in his daily press briefing if there are any elevated threats to our city. Uh, we're watching that very closely. Uh, we do not have a specific incredible threat directed at New York City right now, uh, but we are watching closely and obviously our counterterrorism apparatus can move very quickly if we see anything of direct concern to us.